Hi guys, welcome back to my channel. If you're new here, hi, my name is Stacey, it's lovely to meet you. If you're already existing, thank you so much for coming back. So before we actually get into the video, which as you can see from the title is a Shein haul, I just want to remind you about the giveaway I've got going for this beautiful bag. Um, everything you need to do will be listed in the description box. So yeah, it's actually getting closer now to where I'm giving it away. So a limited time to enter. So yeah, go enter and uh, yeah, you'll be in the running to win this. Also, before we get into the video, I need to pull a card. I need this this week, guys. Honest to God. If you had seen last week with my um my pack with me video, Josh was going into hospital. Um, he had the most horrendous time. Bless him. I'm not gonna, I'm not gonna go into it too much, but pretty much he he's gone through a lot, and basically we could have lost him. So I need to get back into the videos need a distraction need to just get on with everything so I'm gonna pull a card so as always I'm going to shuffle and then just split the deck and then we'll pick from the top so this is a pretty one it's up the ocean and let's see what this one says I can stand my ground I know what's right I know what's wrong that's absolutely on point for what happened down the hospital yeah, needed this today. I'm definitely going to be doing my um, tarot reading later as well because I just need some little bit of guide guidance. So yeah, that is it for this week. I will write it in the description box and it'll be posted over on my Instagram like it always is. But yeah, let's get on with the video. So I'm going to jump straight in with the Shein haul. I'm going to start off with the little bits that I had. So I picked up this pack of um, chain extenders because I have um, a Christian Dior necklace which I've put on a lot of weight with my neck so I can't get it on so I picked up these so that I could, I'm able to wear it um, can't remember how much these were but they were like £2 maybe, maybe even less than that and I think there's 5 in there, 5 chains next up I always do my nails and I've got 2 of the products on now so I bought a pack of these I think these were £1.49 for the two sheets. So as you can see, I've used them. They are so, so pretty. I like like the vintage look and I haven't had um, nail stickers for a while. So I picked those up. And the other thing I used was this gel varnish. When I first opened it, um, I seen that and I thought, oh no, they've sent me like a silvery one but when you open it it is a beautiful um like a milky white so so pretty and i love it because it makes the nails look natural that's actually this on really really happy with this i think this was about two pound as well uh sticking with nail stickers i picked up these other like vintage looking ones i'm sure these were around one pound fifty as well or these might have been two pound you only get the one sheet of these but these are like the sorry for shaking the camera these are like the raised ones if you can see so it's like all vintagey really really pretty so i've got like loads of vintage frames bows like brushes um i don't know what it says on there to be honest but it's got love and I think it might be like French or something but yeah these are really really pretty so I'm using these for my next nails I think absolutely love them there's loads of them on it which I'm going to be purchasing a bit more sticking with the nails I picked up a base coat and top coat this is from Tomica never tried these ones but I think this was like £3.50 for the both so bargain and then I picked up these spider gels. So I always see these, but I've never, never tried them before. So these are literally, I'll, I'll put a picture in if I can, if I remember to, I'll put a picture in. I'm not going to open it because I'm not going to use it yet. But it's like, it's literally like a gloopy gel sort of, and you can like drag it over the nails. Um, I'll show you in the picture. It'll be easier to see in the picture. But these weren't very much either, and these came as a set. And then the last little bit I had, because I do bullet journaling, journaling, this is Time Manuscript Series. So this is um, original retro English paper tape. Okay, so this is what it looks like. 
so you can actually tape this into um, a bullet journal so it's got poems and things on there um, when I use it I post it on Instagram probably on my stories but they have loads of these there as well absolutely love stuff like this just makes the bullet journal really really pretty so yeah that's the last of the little bits I didn't do a massive Shein haul but I've got four clothing items now so I am a UK size 16 to 18 depending on fabrics and stuff just for reference and I am five foot two just about so the first thing I picked up was this gorgeous jumper well it's long enough to be a jumper dress if I'm being honest um, but it's this like cable knit pattern it's got really puffy arms but then it's got long um, cuffs really really pretty goes quite low obviously you see better now in the try on clip but this is gorgeous I really love this one and they had a few different colors of this as well let's go try it on so this is the first jump I've just put it on with some grey ribbed leggings see it comes down quite far I couldn't wear it as a, a dress but I mean pair of shorts on you really could the sleeves are what are my favorite I just think they're so comfortable they're nice and loose this is nice and loose I definitely could have gone down a size and you can tuck it in leave it out I would probably pair this with some maybe some biker boots and then a nice bag this bag would look really nice with it let's pan you up a tiny bit yeah I think this bag would look nice with it although it looks cream compared to the top but I still think it looks nice love this really happy with this one next up I have some pajamas and this type of material isn't my favorite but I don't mind it I do prefer cotton ones but it's this like um the silky material you know so it's just these black and white and green one says Los Angeles 91 just plain and then it's got full length trousers with it the trousers are not cuffed but they are really stretchy might even be a bit too big but yeah let's go try these on you know the pajamas they're actually like normally the feeling of these um i wouldn't like i had a pair of these for christmas not these specific ones but this type of material and they fit really comfortable <coughs> sorry they fit really comfortably so i thought i would try these ones the only thing i i wish they had was pockets and cuffs at the bottom I much prefer cuffs on my pajama bottoms but yeah they fit lovely I got them in a 1xl as well definitely wouldn't go down or up a size in these I think they are lovely and perfect and fit comfortably so yeah successful shop next up if you saw my vintage haul I'm sure that the ones on there were off Shein the the brown um, set the shirt and tr baggy trousers so I found a similar and I thought I would try them so these are the trousers they are definitely a different um, fabric but they are basically the same full length in this nice like toby not toby beigey color um, there isn't a tag on these so might not even add them off Shein, that person might not have. But they are a tiny bit see-through, but they would be fine with um, nude underwear. So that are the, so those are the trousers. And the top is extremely creased. But it is um, just a button shirt, really long. So you could wear these together or separate as well, which we love that. So yeah, let's go try these on. Okay, so this two piece, nothing like my other one. Um, this fabric, although it's super stretchy, 
it clings to you quite a lot um so i definitely would not wear these separate unless i was just wearing the trousers with like a baggy t-shirt or something but let me pan you down the trousers are not too bad okay so this is what i mean about how clingy they are they literally show every lump and bump which is fine if you don't mind showing they are probably about the right length with some oops some shoes on so i would probably pair mine with either my air forces or these brown ones and then i would have this one to go with it so let me show you what it would look like like this so yeah i mean it's fine it's nice it's just i went for i think it was a 1xl which should be an 18 and i still feel like in the top i could have gone a lot bigger you'll probably disagree but i love oversized things but yeah just bear that in mind if you're picking it up that it is quite a clingy material don't know what material it is but it's quite clingy okay so last up i bought a shirt and i'm hoping this fits because it is stunning so it is this blue and white striped one i'm not gonna lie stripes sort of make my eyes go funny lately but i love them okay again so i actually don't like the fabric of these be nice and cool for the summer though but i do prefer like a cotton i don't even know what fabric this is oh so i got this in a 1xl it actually doesn't say what the fabric is but um yeah summertime this would be lovely and cool so let's go try this on definitely size down if you are thinking about getting this it's really big but i'm still gonna keep it because i love oversized things um but yeah even with a little belt around would look quite nice i think but oh forgot to do the buttons up but yeah it's nice and loose nice and baggy very thin so like i say it's going to be really nice for summertime I'm in love with it but yeah size down guys if you are planning on getting it okay guys so I hope you enjoyed that video for today next up I actually have a charity shop um yeah I got a charity shop challenge video and then after that I think is a tiktok one so yeah hope you enjoyed don't forget about the competition like this video share it with a friend if you don't mind don't forget to subscribe head over to my instagram all the details are down below and I will also link everything that I have shown today down below as well. So see you next time. Bye guys.